And welcome back to Ninja Gaiden Sigma 2, Chapter 12, Part 2, Master Ninja Mode. First thing I'm going to do is get rid of the stupid cannon. I'm going to switch to the Tonfa. And while I'm at it, I guess I'll switch to the Wind Blades. The fact that they can hit each other with cannonballs is stupid! Ugh. Nice try, bitch! Oh! <laughs> And another one. Ah, oh, screw this. Scythe time. them off fast. And we're gonna switch to the Dragon Sword for this next part. Use the Flying Swallow against a lot more of those cannon-firing bastards on the other side of this. treasure chest up here, but I'm not sure. No, I don't think there is. They don't explain how those guys died or what killed them. Uh. Oh, what are you doing? The next one! Ugh. Say goodnight! Uh. I do fucking hate those bugs. There you go. Uh, screw it. I'm using the scythe. Those stupid shells. Switch back to the dual swords. Let's make 
make sure we got the wind blades out. I do hate these small worm things. It almost looks like they changed Ryu's shadow again. As if he had a, you know, dynamic shadow instead of that classic pre-rendered shadow that's always below his feet. Here comes a brand new boss. Now in the 360 version, you would not fight this. You would fight two of those dragons that she was riding. But she wasn't on any of the ones that you fought, but you did not fight this. And I actually preferred this. This is a much better fight. What kind of a dragon ninja would Ryu be if he didn't slay a dragon every now and then? Fairly easy boss uh, with that technique, but you have to watch out. The Master Ninja, if he hits you, most of the stuff will almost kill you. Anyway, that's it for chapter 12. Stay tuned for chapter 13.